We are here today understanding heart failure, its causes, symptoms and how do we manage this condition. So what is heart failure? Heart failure is a chronic condition which occurs when the heart is unable to pump blood efficiently. This inadequate supply of blood to the cells causes fatigue, shortness of breath and accumulation of fluid in the limbs, belly and the lungs, thereby seriously impacting the quality of life. Why there are many reasons for advanced heart failure, the commonest are the diseases of the heart muscle termed cardiomyopathy. And one of the most important causes for this can be a heart attack. It's crucial to note that end-stage heart failure is a condition that cannot be reversed and it develops over time as the heart progressively loses the ability to maintain circulation for important body function. So what are the risk factors? Heart failure is common among the elderly, though there's an increasing incidence of this condition among young adults mainly because of risk factors caused by environmental stress, diabetes, obesity and hypertension which are significantly rising. The warning signs can be fatigue, shortness of breath, confusion, rapid or regular heartbeats, swelling in the feet and legs and difficulty in sleeping due to, uh, due to fluid accumulation in the lungs. There's a loss of appetite associated with all of this. So how do you manage this condition? In the early stages, the treatment generally consists of medications, as I mentioned earlier, and certain changes to lifestyle. While as uh, these stages get more advanced, maybe a corrective surgery like a valve replacement or a surgical reduction of a dilated ventricle or a device implantation can be necessary in some patients. But in some of them, these symptoms progress and the heart becomes so weak that a transplant is the only option. But this option is limited by availability of a donor heart. However, while undergoing a transplant, some external factors are beyond our control such as the availability of a donor uh, with an increasing number of patients waiting for transplants and sometimes precluded by the patient's medical condition. In some of these cases, we need technologically advanced substitutes for the heart which are called left ventricular assist devices. An LVAD is a battery operated mechanical pump which allows supporting the left ventricle which pumps blood to the body. The long-term survival after this operation is currently now equaling or probably even exceeding those of heart transplantations. And over a period of time, because the advancement of technology, the miniaturization of the device and it becoming more affordable and effective, it's being used as a substitute to a heart transplant. It's important for us to remember that avoidance of heart diseases necessitate us to make some changes in our lifestyle and we need to be proactive. So we need to maintain a healthy weight need to exercise regularly and engage in outdoor activities, eat fruits and vegetables, whole grains and protein. Do not smoke or consume recreational drugs, limit the intake of alcohol, try to minimize stress in your daily life and at least try to get 7 to 8 hours of good restful sleep. These are some of the methods which would help us alleviate some of the risk factors which could eventually lead to chronic ischemic heart disease and unfortunately in some cases which could advance to heart failure caused by ischemic cardiomyopathy. Take care of yourself and all the very best. Brought to you by Vedyanath Ayurvedic. Vedyanath Ayurvedic 100% vegetarian toothpaste Ayudant.